All right, what's up, guys? Now, I think I did mention this when I did um, the review on this shoe. Um, and if I didn't, then I apologize. That was my mistake. But uh, anyways, are Zion 1s true to size? Now, um, I know like with like these newer shoes, it can be a little bit harder to tell because I know there's been some like newer lines of shoes where I've tried them on. They, You would think that they would be true to size, but they're not. And yeah, you know, it's um, it, it's crazy. It's like there's some shoes out there. I was like, I think it was a, a pair of um, LeBron shoes. I think it was the 17s, I think. And I think I think it was the 17s. Yeah, because I got the 19s. I think, yeah, and I had got the 18s. Yeah, so it was the 17s. And um, no, like I remember I went and got those shoes and I had to go up half a size. And so with some of the newer basketball shoes, you don't really, I didn't hit my microphone. You don't really know like if they are true to size or not. And so that's why I'm doing this video to let each and every one of you guys know if Zion ones are true to size. And to answer the question shortly, yes, they are. And to give you guys a long thought out answer, they are true to size. Um, you know, putting these shoes on, they're not like too small fitting or, you know, feels like your foot's going to be sliding all over. And I feel like with, um, you know, Zion, I feel like, you know, somebody of his like, he, he's a he's a large man. OK, <laughs> he's a large man. I feel like he has to have like some stable shoes. He can't be out there wearing some shoes that feels like Tim's. So that's why I'm like, nah, these shoes, they're pretty uh, tight on the foot and stuff. You know, upper, it's uh, like, you know, very tight on the feet. Especially, you know, if you, like, I mean, even if you, like, lace them up just a little and don't put too much strength in it, like, in it. But me, I'm like, nah, I be, like, pulling the shoelaces. I don't pull them that far out. But, no, I just make sure of it that the shoes are tight. And it doesn't feel uncomfortable because the tongue, it's, uh, it's pretty cushioning and stuff. So, it's like, you don't have to worry about the tongue, like, digging directly into your feet. And no, there is actually, I um, wore, it wasn't these ones, it was another pair of Zion uh, shoes that I have, same model, and I wore those um, out on, on a, like a road trip, was it, what, which road trip was it, was it to Oregon, I think it was the Oregon, yeah, it was the Oregon, and um, no, them shoes are like, they're mad comfortable, so like, if you are like, you know, yeah, comfort wise, like, yeah, they're chill, but true to size wise, yeah, these shoes, they're, they're true to size. You don't have to worry about these shoes um, not overall being... What's this? I don't know what that was, but... Anyways, um, but yeah, you don't have to worry about these shoes um, being, like, you know, too loose-fitting or too tight. Like, they're perfect. So if you are a size 10, stick with a size 10. If you're a 9.5, stick with that. 9, stick with that. You don't have to go up. And if you want to, there probably is a store that uh, has these shoes or might have another pair of shoes, um, Zion ones, where you can try them on if you want to to see for yourself. But if you just want to see real quick... Are Zion ones um true to size? They are. So in my opinion, you know, others others feet may be differently um different. So they you know might tell you a different thing. So it's it's always best like you know when you see videos like this, just go in the store to just you know get like that confirmation for yourself. So you uh will overall know like hey are these shoes true to size or not? Because yeah, I think these shoes there. I remember I, it wasn't these ones because these ones are the latest colorway I believe. It well, not actually. Well, yeah, they were like one of the latest. But anyways, um, they had the bread colorway in the uh on the shelves for a little bit. I think it was that, and they have like some white and black ones, and they might have some other ones that you can possibly get, um, uh, on, like in the store and stuff. So if you can, um, I definitely will recommend trying the shoes on to see for yourself. Uh, but I think Nike, I think Nike has a thing where like you can take the arm um, to return the shoe and stuff if it is too small for you. So, uh, yeah, it's best to, um, you know, do that if you can. But um, if not, then, yeah, you know, it's probably best to try it. Um, try it on a store if you really want to know and stuff. So uh, anyways, um, but I'm trying to think because maybe if you have like if there's a reselling store that you can go to and they, if they have these, then see. But if not, then I don't know what to tell you, but. Yeah, um, yeah, hopefully you uh, like your Zion ones and stuff. So anyways, and that being said, I will talk to y'all later. Thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and peace.